Hi everybody, I'm Randy Peterson. Joining me today, Jacob Buttriff. And today, Jacob's gonna talk about tempo. Jacob, what does tempo mean to you and how do you go about getting good tempo? Well, Randy, obviously some, a lot of people on this planet know that I have one of the most unique styles on tour, if not the most unique. For me, it's just a matter of going out and bowling and just making sure I'm in the same rhythm, go, going shot by shot. Um, it, it's really easy for me to like just say like trip over my own two feet, <laughs> they say. So uh, when I go out and practice, it's just a matter of like repeating the shots that you can because um, I, I do this drill to where I go 10, 20, 30, 40. So uh, it's just a matter of playing that one part of the lane and just kind of just staying in that rhythm. The 10, 20, 30, 40 is the boards that Jacob is playing on the lanes. Helped me through college a lot and I've just kind of gone with the flow with that. So what happens when you get out of tempo or out of rhythm? What do you think about? Uh, for me, it, it just becomes mind-boggling because it just adds one of those things to my head that shouldn't be needed <laughs> when, I, when I bowl. So, uh, and when I, whenever that happens, I just kind of like take a step back and just kind of re rethink, revamp, and then boom, I'm back onto the races. Jacob's approach to the foul line. Right. I mean, it's, it's everything that goes beyond that as well. How he holds the ball and, and the release is yeah. bizarre. And would you say that your tempo is best when it's on the slower side or on the faster side? Uh, for me, it's like an in between because. Uh, Lately, I've been better on the faster side. I've been working on that most of the midway through the season, uh, just trying to stay in this fast tempo because uh, obviously everybody knows I love to bowl really fast, and when I just get up and go, then that's when I strike the most. And I know we're, we're here talking about tempo, but I have to ask you this since we have you on camera. How the heck do you do that thing with your wrist? You know, uh, everybody always asks, and I, I just tell them, I was like, I just broke my wrist when I was little. So. <laughs> Uh, it's just one day I just started bowling like that, um, didn't feel any pain in my wrist, uh, bowled a tournament like that, did really well, and uh, just kind of stuck with it. Great tips from Jacob Butchup on Tempo. Thanks, Jake.